Education and confrontation. Western New Yorkers head to Albany on a mission to get Carl Palladino removed from the Buffalo Public School Board. Western New York parents, educators, and students disrupted the state education department today trying to make their case. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Josh Bazan is live in our newsroom tonight with more on what happened today in Albany. Good afternoon, Keith. More than a dozen protesters from Buffalo made the trip today to the state capitol to have their voices heard by Education Commissioner Mary Ellen Ilya. They gathered in the lobby of the Department of Education building, chanting for the commissioner to remove Carl Palladino from the Buffalo School Board. Four petitions have been filed with the Education Department calling for his removal, and the first hearing in the case has been scheduled for June 22nd. These protesters weren't able to meet with Ilya, but did speak to Deputy Commissioner Elizabeth Berlin. They want Ilya to remove Palladino sooner and also say that hearing should be held in Buffalo instead of Albany. I'm not understanding why it is that this decision about my children and my schools is going to be made in Albany when we live in Buffalo. Commissioner Ilya is the only one who has the power to remove him, so we really hope that she heard what we had to say today and we really hope that she comes to Buffalo to hear from students themselves, parents um, who aren't able to make it out today. The hearing is still going to be held in Albany. A spokesperson with the Education Department tells me that is to maintain consistency with how things have been done in the past. Now, I reached out to Carl Palladino to have his thoughts on all this. Uh, right now, I'm still waiting to hear back. Keith? All right, good. Thanks, Joshua.